Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. Today, I decided I'm gonna do a quarantine haul. I decided to do a haul of everything I bought during quarantine because I've realized that if I come into money, I will spend it. So why not share? Why not share what I've bought? So, I, I thought instead of having to do like a try on haul type of thing, I'm just gonna talk and try things on but first I have a few like extras sort of I'll just I'll just show so first things first I bought something off of Amazon so I'm gonna show that first because it's not clothing yeah I got a waist trainer along that center the waist trainer. So, the way you wear it, let me just go back. I got off Amazon. Don't know what brand it's from, honestly. It was really random. One of my late night Amazon binges, you know, where you just sit and look at things. So I decided to buy it. Just wrap it around like this. And it has like elastics. It cinches the waist. I so I don't really it's so loud. I'm gonna do an a review on it somewhat. It worked okay. I don't really know how well waist trainers work to begin with. Like I don't don't know the science behind it. I just know forgot I had a back injury, like a minor one, during volleyball season this year. And so that, I slept at it. I don't even know if you're supposed to do that or not. I don't, I don't know anything about it. It really, I don't know. I just bought it because I was hoping it would make me skinny. But it made me pull, like, re-pull the muscle in my back. So that hurt. And I stopped wearing it and the muscle healed. So I haven't really worn it that much, but I kind of forget I have it. But I don't really know. It hasn't done anything dramatically to me, but I only wore it for like two weeks straight. I don't know. It's cute though. So the next thing I have is shoes. I got these Converse cheetah print off the Converse website, I think. They're super cute. I got them in a size nine. I think I got them on sale, actually. I was watching a lot of shoe hauls, staying at home, you know, living my life. And so I saw these and they were so cute. She looked so cute in them. I was like, I have to buy them right now. So I found them online. I honestly don't know the price of them. Pretty sure they were 90. But I got a student discount on them, so. But anyways. So those this is my only pair of shoes I bought because I'm not made of money and shoes are expensive. Anyways. The next thing I have that I bought, which is I'm getting into clothing. But the first thing I want to show is my bathing suits. And I'm not trying them on. Because, you know, just not. So, I'm gonna show you all and put it on me First, first bathing suits, which aren't real bathing suits. I bought them at this boutique while I was at the beach. And I just got these. They're super cute. They have tassels like this and that and all that. And I love them. And I wear them with like one of my red tops. I guess I could wear them with a pink top. I don't really know. Or like a blue, but I don't really. I don't wear them that much blue, but I love like the print printed bottoms. So I had to get them. And I also got these bottoms because they were $5. So I was like. Might as well, you know, I like them. And they have a 
cool pattern on them as well. And I could wear them with a red top or a black top or whatever I feel like, a pink purple. I thought it was adorable. It just looks like this close up. And so that's the only, those are the two bottoms I got. And then I got one more bathing suit. I got this bathing suit set from Target. I was at Target. Oh, that's the back. And I got these tie bottoms. And I got these in a large because that was all they had. So just tie them tighter because I'm normally a medium. So I like tie bottoms because I can kind of adjust where I put them on my hip. And then I got the ever basic, like, I don't even know, ruffled cup type thing with the tie in the front, even though it's not tied right now. But I just feel like everyone and their mom has some variation of this because I know I've seen it on Zaffle and stuff with this. And I have a really, really weird tan line now because of it, but it is what it is. But anyways, I think it's really cute. It's I think it's flattering on a lot of people. I don't know if it's the most flattering top on me, but I like it. So I like the style of it. I like to be trendy, you know. And um, Target always has like the nicer, not the nicest, but like nice for the price because like it has, you know, the metal clasps instead of plastic and stuff like that because they're fine, but they break easily. And so I've been at pools a lot and like they've broken, the clasps have broken and that's just embarrassing. That's for, that story for another time. <laughs> now, I'm going to show you guys my clothes. Most interesting part. So, first I'm going to show you what I'm wearing because these are both new. My shirt. I got this from Pretty Little Thing. And, wait, did I? Where did I get these bottoms? No, yeah. I got it from Pretty Little Thing. And I saw it, and I, I've watched Space Jams before, but I really like the graphic tea trend that is kind of going on, where it's like oversized. So I got it in a size large, so that's super cute. And then, pants I'm wearing, I'm on a bench with bangs. I made these, I got the original pants, the Wrangler, and I got them from Gabe's, or like Gabriel Brothers for like $12 and so I just cropped them because longer shorts are coming back into fashion so got these but next okay so I'm gonna show everything else I got from Pretty Little Thing let me stand on my bench again oh I'm gonna fall I got these shorts I got these shorts, they're just like baggy sweat shorts. Got them also from Pretty Little Thing. And I think they go pretty well with the shirt I got, so you can wear it like this, or you can hook it in and wear it. Just anyway, you want with, I normally wear them with like higher tube socks, you know, or like Nike Elite socks and some type of shoe. I normally wear them with my Adidas Stan Smiths, but you can wear them with like Air Force Mons or I don't know, any other shoe, any like athletic shoe. So next, the last thing, well actually, I'll just change fits. This is the last thing I got from Pretty Little Thing. It's just this crop top that like cinches, it has like ruching I think, or gathering and then little ties on it. And then I have, it's see-through. So I got this bralette, um, well I've had it, and it's from Air Postal, but I got it like two summers ago or something like that. So I'm not really sure if you can get something, like if you can get the exact one, but you can get one that's similar looking to it. That's, you just need to like a basic white bralette, and so yeah. But anyways, talking about Air Postal, I got some shorts from Air Postal because I had a gift card. So I'm going to show you guys those. As you can see, you can see the workout bench, but I decided to lower my camera so that I could 
show the shorts more realistically, but they're from Aeropostale. They're just light wash. Um, I really love the cuts. And I, they were double rolled, but I unrolled one because they were way, way too short on me before. But I like them. Give them like a 10 out of 10. They're cute. They kind of write up though, so that's my only problem with them. So the next store I'm going to show is Misguided. So from Misguided, I just got this Razorback top. And it's super see-through as well. I mean, ooh little hanger things i paid like seven dollars for it so like you get what you pay for and it's not that bad with the bralette under it i got this from misguided and i also got a bikini top but it just did not fit me well so i'm gonna give it to one of my friends and that's all i got from misguided actually so i just got this top that i'm keeping so now i'm gonna show you the pants i actually bought this top to go with these biker shorts that I got. These are the biker shorts I got. They are really cute. I actually snagged them from the 90 degree legging website. They're, they were like normally $80 but I think I got them for $20 because they were on sale. So I thought that this would look cute together but I think it looks cute with like a big shirt on and all that other stuff too. I also work out in these because they are like athletic, like they, you know, like spandex. So that's the only thing I got from 90 degree legging as well. So now I am going to show y'all what I got from American Eagle. So this is the top I got from American Eagle. It's just a basic halter top that's ribbed with the back out of it. And so I thought it was really cute. I got it for like $18, I think. I think it's actually pretty cute with this bralette under it. To match with it, I got this maxi skirt, which you can't even tell. But it's a flowy maxi skirt with a slit. But it's really cute, flowy, you know. Do a little jig in it, but I really like it. I have one more thing from American Eagle. So the last thing I got from American Eagle is just this cute, Short summery dress it has like a square neck with a flowy and it just comes to like mid thigh and the back of it is like completely open. My tan lines are very bad. But I really like it. I really love the green color. It's super cute. And I like the purple that's kind of incorporated in it. In the pattern and so I've I've worn it like 10 times since I got it so that's when you know it's good I've already worn it to functions but I like the like three-quarter sleeve action when it's kind of like puffy it's super comfortable and it's super thin and I think I got it for like I want to say 40 and I think I got the skirt for 30, 25 to 30 in that area. So now I have two tops left. Two tops left from two different places. So I'm going to just briefly talk about those. So I went to H&M and this is the only thing I picked up, which is a milkmaid type of top, I think, with ruching all on this part of it and then it's kind of like more fitted it's but it has like stretch in the back so you have a little bit of leeway with what you want to do with that okay. got it in like a six i'm not really sure six or an eight one of those two but it has like an elastic band on the arms which I think it's interesting but I don't know it's not really my type but I've seen that like fluffy um, puffy sleeves have become quite popular so I decided I wanted to invest in that okay so the last top I got is from Walmart uh, I found, me and my friend went to Walmart and we saw these shirts 
And I know it's like a TikTok trend to buy these shirts nowadays, but I got it in lavender and then we decided to try and bleach it. It's a lot more vibrant on camera than it is in person, but I like it. It's a super cute top to just throw on. And so I appreciate it. I think I'm gonna end this video here. I think I'm gonna end it. Uh -huh. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this video was short, but I need something to film and something to put out, some content to put out. So I wanna thank you guys so much for watching to the end and comment down below video ideas because I'm lacking. All I'm doing is vlogging. But I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you next week.